Now let's turn our attention to, I think, one of the coolest surf competitions on the local calendar. The best in South African surfing will be on display this weekend as the Geordie Smith Cape Town Surf Pro takes place on the West Coast at Big Bay, Cape Town. Mix of top international talents and, of course, up and coming local surfers. They're going to come out to play in front of a buzzing local crowd. It makes us feel like summer is here all over again. Let's chat a little bit about it. Well, there is only one man we could talk to. That's Jordy Smith. Jordy, welcome back, dude. Thanks so much. Thanks for having me. Uh, so good to have you. I know this is like a, a whistle-stop tour for you, bro. It's a, it's a big year for you, a competitive year. Um, give us a bit of background. The 2018 Jordy Smith Cape Town Surf Pro, an opportunity for, I'm sure, when you take yourself back to those early days, for young surfers to make a name for themselves. But this is a pretty competitive field when we look at it. How are you feeling about this year's comp? Um, yeah, to be honest, it's uh, mixed emotions. Um, obviously, very happy and excited to be able to give back and uh, yeah, just give the local talent and the South Africans an opportunity to be able to get some great points and qualify to, uh, to be on the big stages. But then, um, I guess because we in the past we've had such great waves and so many and such great conditions, a lot of the international surfers have come out for it, and so. Uh, yeah, it's a, it's a bit tough. It's, yeah, it's very <laughs> tough. Um, I really hope a South African can take it out, take it out, and uh, take away all the money and the points. Um, dude, you are obviously your your focus has to be kind of tunnel vision at the moment. Um, the World Tour going really well now, eighth on the log after two brilliant performances. Well done in Bali. Every surfer on set, I was joking with you earlier, has come to me like, "Done, well done for Bali, well done for Bali, man." Um, how are you feeling? How what's the 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 mindset at this stage is number one there. Is that the goal? How, how are you feeling, man? Um, to be honest, I feel really good. Probably at this point in the year, I feel better than I've ever felt um, in any year. Um, yeah, sitting eighth is not the best, but uh, just coming off some two, two really good results, there's a lot of confidence. Um, and yeah, so I'm just going to go down to J Bay. That's obviously yeah. our next event. And uh, just try and practice as much as I can down there. Luckily, I'll be in front of my friends and family and a home crowd. and. Uh, yeah, I'll put on the best performance I can. Uh, how much do you miss the home crowd now based in California and obviously a global citizen traveling the world as much as you are? How cool is it coming back and surfing in front of the, the hometown? It's the best feeling in the world, to be honest. Um, yeah, just to be in front of, like I said, your friends and family and everyone that you've grown up in front of is uh, a really special feeling. And um, yeah, anytime I win at home, you know, I don't feel like I just win it for me. I win it for everyone and uh, everyone that's a part of, you know, South African surfing and uh, yeah, everyone that supports me. You, you're a seasoned campaigner now, and I, I know you've gone through this life cycle so many times. How do you prepare yourself for the second half or, or the latter stages of a, of a season like this? Do you take it competition by competition, or is it now reached that point now where you know, okay, I need to get semis, I need to get, you know, how do you, how do you mentally prepare yourself? Because you're also one of the freest surfers yeah. on the circuit, and it just feels like you're kind of freestyling when you go out there, but I know that's not the, the case. Yeah, look, I think there's a time and place for everything. Um, uh, you've just really got to separate, you know, you've got to separate your free surf trips from, your, from the competition. And, um, yeah, when you're there for the event, you've just got to be 100% in the mindset of, like, I'm, d I'm there to win and that's, it. that's all I'm there for. And, uh, yeah, it, it's, at times it kind of sucks because, you know, you, you get to go to these beautiful locations and you, you want to go and check them out, but at the same time you are there to, for a job and, um, yeah, you've got to come away with the Ws. Uh, and you're also there with all your mates as well. Yeah. You guys, you, you've lived <laughs> together, you've toured together for so long. Um, Jordy, thank you so much, first of all, for the, the Cape Town Pro. I know a lot of young surfers desperate to emulate what you've done. Um, but most importantly, well done this year, dude, and, and go and seal the deal. Thanks so much. Seal the yeah. deal, bro. We look forward to having you back for the J-Bay Open. Um, but go and support some local talent. They're going to need it against a very tough field in the Jordy Smith Cape Town Pro.